a bit of a change of plan. If you watched yesterday's video, you know we ended it by saying that tomorrow morning we'd be looking around Florence. Now that was the original plan, but then all of a sudden after looking at a map, we realized that uh, there was a better plan, effectively. And that's what we're gonna go do. So we've hopped into the car, packed it up last minute. We were gonna wash the car, but we haven't had time to do that. And now we're rushing over to a very, very special place to both of us. As I sit here editing, we are trying, well, apart from Paul Wallace, I think we're probably the only people who would come up with this idea. We're trying to get our range as high as possible in the Ferrari. What are we at now? 729. 729 kilometers on basically a full tank. Yeah. As soon as we put our foot down, that will go down to 500, but we're gonna see if we can get it to 800. The issue is we're going 80 kilometers an hour. We are going 80 kilometers an hour. 740. 740? Yes. Oh, he's jumping up. Let's see, 740 right there. Oh, 740. 749. Yes. I don't know why I'm so excited about this. I know, it's so excited. <laughs> There's a bus coming over to, to speed take up us. A little bit. What are we at? 767, and we can't get any further than that. Not bad, though, considering when we left Turin, we were slightly on it, and now we've only been cruising for about, what, like half an hour? Uh, bro, we're never in Turin. Oh, did I say Turin? <laughs> this is all getting very confusing. I meant Florence. We're back down to 766. So, oh, okay, now it's downhill from here now. Spoiler alert! That's right, we decided to come to the home of the car that we were driving. Ferrari. The roundabout, take a second exit onto Via Grisaga. Will do. But yes, this seems like uh, the place to be. Right there, that is the entrance to the Ferrari factory. We're gonna go towards the museum. Can you stop oh, it? I figured if we're doing a road trip around Italy in a Ferrari, we might as well come to where these cars are built, right? So it's a quick little stop off and then we're heading somewhere else. You know what I've just seen? I've seen our first Ferrari in oh. Marinello. Oh. Thumbs up to him. That is very cool. Very, very cool. GTC4 Lusso. Second one so hey, far, Cali. I think, I feel like we're going to see a lot of Ferraris. Yeah, I'm guessing. I got a hunch. First of all, we definitely have the dirtiest Ferrari there is right here. Second of all, my friend is very tempted to rent a Ferrari. You're probably the only person I know who shows up in a Ferrari to rent a Ferrari. But we're gonna shop around. We've been to this place, but it's quite expensive to rent a... Which one do you wanna go for? Speciale? Yeah, the dream is Speciale, but... Uh, I don't know, I mean, 48 could be cool. F12 yeah. could be cool. Never Let's, driven any of these, so... Exactly, any Let's look around, see what we've got and see if we want to test drive. That didn't go so well. You're disappointed. Uh, it's too expensive. It's nearly 400 euros to go out for, what, 15 minutes, 20 minutes yeah. in an F12, so. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're, we're already in a California, so it doesn't make a, doesn't make too much sense, does it? He is super pissed. He was so excited to drive an F12. Little does he know, I just told Ago that we need to move the car over there because they might clean it for us. I actually spoke to the guys and uh, we're lucky enough that they watch some of these videos, which is sick. So he's actually going to be able to drive the Ferrari F12 for free, which is super sick. Epic from them. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming, I'm coming. <laughs> you ready to go clean the car? At least we're getting a car wash. Jesus, that's loud. Yeah. Look, better than nothing, we're getting a car wash. What's the point of coming all the way to Maranello for a car wash though? Yeah, it's true, it is true. I'm sure you'll get to drive one one day. Well, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully buy one, that would be <laughs> ideal. Look, there it is, Ago. There's okay. the F12. <laughs> <laughs> Hilarious. What if I were to tell you that we're actually not getting a car wash? What do you mean? We're not even gonna get a car wash. I just kind of wanted to come back here. What, to tell me I'm an idiot because I can afford that? No, to tell you that you're gonna get to drive it. Yeah, for 500 euros? No, I'm fine. Nah, not for 500 euros. For free. How? Oh. Because, because I spoke to a few people and it's happening now. You're gonna get to drive that F12 for nothing. Are you <gasps> kidding me? No, <laughs> no, I'm being serious. I'm being dead serious. You're gonna drive an F12. No. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, let's go do it. Come on, hop out the car, let's do it. What? Yeah, I'm not joking, dude. I'm not joking. The red F12, yeah, V12 Ferrari. I'm gonna give you some cameras though and I'm gonna wanna film you. I want some good reactions. Okay. Yeah, let's do it. I'm down. I'm down. <laughs> yeah. I'm you kinda... seem very focused. <laughs> yeah, I'm kinda overwhelmed. I'm so happy for you, dude. Enjoy this. Naturally aspirated V12. It's not every day you get to drive an F12. Oh. <laughs> Bye. All right, listen, <laughs> have fun, yeah? Be careful, I'll be waiting for you here. Oh my god! 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 Oh my
se ne andiamo dritto Mamma mia, sono pisti Just got him back. <laughs> I was I was on this kind of highway thing, full throttle. The back just steps out. I'm like, what? You can see on the video. It's crazy. Was it good? Come in. <laughs> How was it? Are you on an adrenaline come down now, bro? Yeah. Look at my hand. Dude, listen, I'm so happy you got to enjoy that. I don't know how to thank you, man. Honestly. At least it's another highlight to the road trip. Oh, oh, it is. On to our next, our next destination now. Sounds so good, doesn't it? Next destination I'm almost more excited for. I know you just had an absolute adrenaline high. Yeah. But now it's time to head somewhere extremely special to me and potentially the place that got me into cars in the first place. If you know, then you know. This is the Pagani factory, the old Pagani factory, because about a year ago they moved to a new place. They still use this for certain aspects, but this is where all the history comes from. My friend's never been here before, so we thought we'd stop by here. We haven't told anyone we were coming or prepared anything, so we literally just sat outside the door looking, and hopefully when we go to the new place, there will be some cool cars hanging around that we'll be able to film. But yeah, it's literally just to come see. So, the original Pagani factory. Pretty epic. Yep, that's uh, that's how you park. But we found the new Pagani factory. Now this is this is much more like it. This place is massive compared to the old one. Just to give you an idea of how dirty the car is. Right, let's we just sort of oh yeah, let's just walk in, see what happens. That is beautiful. Apparently someone's gonna come see us. We've been waiting around for how long have we been here? I don't know, half an hour. We have to go. We got in and unfortunately we weren't able to film this, but we both just went all around the factory, saw the production line, saw the cars that will be heading to customers soon. So we saw a bunch of epic specs. There was like an orange one with the Cinque stripe, which, okay, let's talk about this slightly. There is a Cinque right there. How crazy is this? We're in the museum. We can't show you the whole thing because then obviously you'd be able to just sit here and there'd be not much point to come and see it. But please, if you're around this area, do what we did and just stop by because this is really worth seeing. I mean, a Zonda, this is chassis number five, Zonda Cinque Roadster. Insane. And then we've got like Zonda Fs. There's just, there's so much stuff around here. So yeah, absolutely fantastic to have been able to look around here. And I think another good stop on this road trip, wouldn't you say? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, that's very crazy. It's under Revolution. Yeah, like, say it with the accent. Revolution. Yeah, there we go. There, you get it properly, but yeah. I mean, these things, 7.3 litre naturally aspirated V12s. I think they're the greatest sounding cars in the world. I mean, those are worth millions and millions and millions now. So to be able to see one here is, is unreal. And now, onwards and upwards. We're gonna be slightly naughty now. We're in a petrol station. Why not stop and do some donuts? Go, 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 go! Okay, go, 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 go! Excuse me, coming through! Ciao, bello! We made it 
to our hotel. Long day today. But amazing one. Yeah, today still, was actually still incredible getting day. A head around F12 vibes. F12 was insane for you. Anyways, we're here now. Let's go. Bet. 